new changes coming to Pirate Land Family Camping Resort right here in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Stay tuned for this very important update. Remember the camper storage area? Well, they're getting ready for the ELS side. They removed all the campers and now there's nothing but grass. What's happening everybody? Beaching with the Boons. And today we're gonna to take you down the line between ELS, which purchased one half of Fireland, and the remaining portion of the campground. So right here, is the property line. It runs all the way to Highway 17. So everything on this side is the new ELS and everything on this side is what remains of Pirate Land. So we're gonna take you on a golf cart tour on the property line so you can see both sides and where it splits. Okay, so it runs from 17, like I said, down to this street, you can see the markers. It goes straight down this road right here. We'll show you the markers down this road. So just on this side of the street, you'll find more property line markers. And if you notice, they're running with the power lines. So we just came from that street with all the property line markers. And it runs straight through here now. Some of this line bypasses a lot of the houses, but some do not. Some are right on the edges and some go in between. Let's get to the next street. And we're gonna loop around and go to the next street. So right now, everything to the left side is the new ELS. So each one of these streets has a marker that designates the cut through line. So we were just on the other side of here and the marker actually goes straight through here to the other side of that house. Just the same as it would go straight through here to the next several roads, following the power lines. So they still have the indoor pool sign and we'll find out in a minute if the indoor pool's still there. But I showed you that marker and each one of these roads has a marker that the line's gonna split in between. So you see the power lines that I was talking about, the line follows. It goes from those markers through each one of those roads and it follows straight through here, following the power lines. And what it'll do is it'll get up here a couple houses and it'll cut off to the left. But before we get over on that side, we'll find out about the indoor pool. So I'm not sure if you can see on the other side, but 
that property line marker lines up with this one, which lines up with that one, and so forth. All the way through here. And this is where it cuts. And so what it does is it cuts through here all the way to Market Street, on the other side of these houses. So now we're going to where the indoor pool is, or used to be. And we'll show you what used to be here last year. This was Pirate's Cove, where you could have weddings, receptions, parties, and lots of family gatherings. In the indoor pool, and my favorite, the hot tub, which has been removed Nothing left, just an open field. All right through here. And there's nothing left but some geese, just an open field. Okay, we were just on the other side. Do you see the marker? Right in there, it comes all the way to this marker here and it shoots toward the left. So there it goes all the way down Market Street, all the way to the ocean. And what we'll do is we'll pick this up on the other end of the street. And this is the other side of Market Street. We were just down there at the end the line comes right through here to this marker right here, all the way to the ocean. So this side is ELS, this side is Pirate Land. The indoor pool might be closed, but the outdoor pool is still here and it should be opening sometime around April 1st. And the foot foot course is still here with new pine straw, along with the store and the arcade. And for those who wake up early in the morning, there's a breakfast food truck here. So you don't have to wait until lunch to get you something good to eat. Wondering what to do with those pesky kids? Well, here's our playground for you, right beside the general store. So we're on the Pirate Land side, and if you're used to staying at this, around this bathhouse, it's no longer here. They've replaced it with campsites. And this is the one that was close to the ocean. Well, there you have it. A look of the line, the property line, split in ELS and Pirate Land. Make sure you take some of these amenities in consideration when you're coming down here to camp because they may not be here when you get here. We don't know yet, but I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, Keep beaching.